Good afternoon, Bill Bryant and Barbara Bailey reporting for WKYT, and we are learning more this afternoon about an Eastern Kentucky University football player who was killed in a weekend car crash. 19-year-old Joey Kramer died when his car went over an embankment on Tate's Creek Road in Madison County. WKYT's Hillary Thornton shows us how Kramer is being remembered in our top story at 1230. Hillary? The Colonel's head football coach Dean Hood says 19-year-old Joey Kramer will be greatly missed not just because of what he accomplished out on the field, but because of who he was as a person and the impact he had on their lives. His friends say he was always wearing a contagious smile and you would have never known he was new to the EKU campus. The defensive lineman transferred in from the University of Texas at El Paso and was a graduate of Alter High School in Ohio. Just hours after the Colonel's big home win on Saturday, they found out their teammate had died in a crash. State police say Kramer ran off of the road and over an embankment, crashing into a tree along Tate's Creek Road in Madison County. While investigators try to figure out what exactly happened, the EKU campus is rallying around their football team as they prepare for a big game next week scheduled to play UK at Commonwealth Stadium. Now, EKU's athletic director, Steve Lockmuller, just released a statement saying while Kramer's time here at EKU was short, his impact made on everyone was great. In Richmond, Hillary Thornton, WKYT. Hillary, thank you. The university says counseling services are available for any students, faculty, or staff who need it.